two snipers terrorized the Washington region for more than three weeks in October 2002. John Allen Muhammad and Lee Boyd Malvo shot area residents in a string of attacks that left 10 dead and three seriously wounded. That's the, the supposedly shooting on Rockwell Pike? Yes, yes, I thought it was shooting. We heard a loud bang, sound like a gunshot. I want to see the unit with uh, crime scene. Uh, we got a major crime scene there. What is it? They did either shot. The duo deliberately and randomly assaulted people with a single shot using a rifle. I mean, it, it could be the new wave of terrorism. What better way to terrorize a neighborhood than to start killing people at random in different places? The gunfire typically occurred at gas stations and parking lots. The incident paralyzed the region with fear and became known as the Beltway Sniper Attacks. Person or people have demonstrated a willingness and ability to shoot people of all ages, all races, all genders, and they've struck at different times of the day, different days, and at different locations. The first attack occurred on October 2nd, 2002, when one person was killed. The next day, five people died after being shot at long range over a 15-hour span in Montgomery County, Maryland, and D.C. The youngest victim, 13-year-old Iron Brown, was shot outside his middle school a few days later in Bowie, Maryland. Brown's spleen was removed, as well as parts of his pancreas and liver, but he survived. To think that there is a cold-blooded killer at home taking innocent life, um, I, I weep for those who've lost their loved ones. I am, con I, you know, the idea of moms taking their kids to school and sheltering them from a potential sniper attack is, is not the American I know. People crouched behind their cars while pumping gas and avoided outdoor activities. Schools held recess indoors and sports teams canceled outdoor practices. Muhammad and Malvo left a series of cryptic clues at crime scenes, including tarot cards and notes. Muhammad, who was 41, and Malvo, who was 17, were arrested in a blue Chevrolet Caprice in Frederick County, Maryland, on October 24, 2002. During Muhammad's trial, it was revealed that his estranged wife, Mildred, was the ultimate target of the shootings. Mildred recalled fleeing from Muhammad's abuse with their three children and relocating to Maryland. Muhammad was sentenced to death and executed in 2009 in Virginia. Malvo was sentenced to nine life terms in Virginia and Maryland. I mean, I, I was a monster. If you look up the definition, I mean, that's what a monster is. I, I was a ghoul. I was a thief. I, I, I stole people's lives. 